Hi everyone, I'm Ben Nowak with Do It Molds. And now we're gonna talk about safety using your lead melters. Basically, the first rule of thumb, when you're pouring lead, you wanna be in a well-ventilated area. You wanna either be inside under a hood or with a fan blowing away from you, or in worst case scenarios, you don't have any of those options. You can also use a respirator. Another thing when you're setting up your space to pour lead is you're gonna to want to make sure your area is set up correctly. The first thing you wanna do is put your cord in a secure place where you're not gonna be tripping over it and it's not gonna be in your way. Also, when you're setting up your bottom pour melter, it's recommended that you put it up against a wall where it's not gonna be easily tipped over. The worst thing that could happen is you're gonna tip over this lead melter and then you'll have molten lead everywhere. That's gonna be really dangerous. And then we're getting into safety equipment. As you guys can tell, uh, I'm well protected. I have heat resistant gloves, I have safety glasses, and I have long sleeves. And then when you're done pouring lead at the end of the day, you're gonna wanna make sure you unplug and turn off your lead melter so that's gonna cool down, solidify, and you won't have molten lead sitting in your garage or outdoors.